Now, we know handcrafted gifts are extra special during the holidays, so I'm very excited that we have the Bro Laws here with DIY present ideas. <laughs> Joey and Dave, I'm excited for these. You've got great DIY gifts, but your first one has to do with friendship. Yes, we all remember our friendship bracelets or necklaces. Well, it's yeah. time to take it up to the adult level with a friendship charcuterie board. Ooh, <laughs> so what this a great is idea. A fairly easy DIY, and we want to empower people to take on DIY projects. They don't have to be as hard or look as complicated as they make out to be. Yeah. Yeah. So this is actually fairly easy to do. We've printed out a piece of a puzzle piece, you trace it on. Um, but this way you can hand it out to your friends. So your friends can take them home and when they come back to the next party, they bring their puzzle piece with them along with their favorite Aww. foods. We're connecting people! <laughs> oh, you're so connecting! <laughs> and the tools you need to build it with is just a jigsaw, a pencil, some hardwood, and some oil. And like yeah. Dave said, this is a super easy build. So you just print out a stencil on a piece of paper. We can all cut that out. We've been doing it since kindergarten. Yep. Then you're just going <laughs> to use a marker, mark it out. We suggest using uh, a couple of different types of hardwood. That's what okay. you're seeing here. These aren't stained. It's just a different species of wood. Yeah. That way you can mix it up. It looks more interesting, but it really is as easy as draw line, cut line. Beautiful. Maybe start off with like some cheaper wood first yep. before yep. moving to the more expensive <laughs> stuff though, you know, like hone those skills. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. And I know you were saying something about putting on a stain that is like, it's okay for eating. Exactly. Right? So you have food safe oils food that safe are going to seal that wood and you're not ingesting any toxins. And then <laughs> make sure you're only sharing with families you really like. Yeah. Because like they're responsible for bringing the food on their little piece of the charcuterie board. But I think that is a gorgeous idea. It's beautiful. Okay, your next one. Um, a beautiful idea idea for community building so yes. what is this idea so here we have like a community library Aww. so I was inspired by neighbors of ours who have uh, a fairy garden yeah. and they change it out all throughout the season so I wanted to do something like that for our kids at home mm -hmm. so we've got kind of the community library this is a fairly harder DIY yeah but as you can see it can also be simple start right so we've got a nice little door here with little Christmas books so, so people cute. can take one yeah. and then bring it back. And we've got little Artie the Elf living up front to make sure everybody's keeping an eye on things. You know? Absolutely. And like they said, it's a little bit more complex, but at the end of the day, when you break it down to what the shell is, it's mm -hmm. really just six pieces of wood that are mostly just square cuts. Yeah. So if you have a little bit of skill, this isn't that difficult of an assembly. The big thing comes in when you're dealing with the decorating, because you're just going to build your shell, yeah. mount it to a post, but then you get to channel your inner Michael Lambie with the miniatures. That's right. You're going to decorate this thing. You can go as far out as you want. We've got some cedar shingles on top. Beautiful. We stain the wood. And you can really go as far as you want with the decorating aspect. And I the, just love how you two always think. You always think in terms of friendship, community, like all yeah. of the good things. What, and what's that? And a also mailbox? Like adding a little mailbox to oh. the side of it so that kids can drop off their letters to Santa. And yeah. as adults, we stop thinking about our own dreams, right? Right. And we stop writing them down and speaking yeah. them to an existence. So I think I want to challenge people as adults, yeah. write down your wish list, sprinkle some glitter on that, send it out into the yeah. world, speak it into existence, right? Yeah, no, I still do talk to Santa from time to time. Good. Yeah, Good. I think it's very important to have that relationship Girl. still fresh. Yeah. yeah. Uh, and I love the idea of sharing books within a community like that just speaks right to my heart. It's a beautiful thing. It also totally allows me to keep buying books from Indigo. Yes. <laughs> I get it away. Yeah. Okay, last but not least, uh, the adult present. We've got a present for the grown-ups. What's do. that? This is one of my favorites. It is a shot glass Christmas tree. Oh, Let's get yeah. the party started, right? Yes, sir. Do you want to be remembered when people come to your house? Yes. Give them a shot. So this is something that can sit at your entrance. You can make a smaller version to sit on your table. Yes. So as people come into the party, you can hand them a shot. They can grab one. Yeah. A little alcohol gets people warmed up and open for the holiday season. Even right? if that's maybe the only thing they are drinking. Yeah. Like maybe they just have the shot and then for the rest of it is lemonade. But yeah. it's nice and festive and it, start, it kicks it off nice uh, if they are into drinks. So this project, as you can see, slightly more advanced than yes. the other two. So I feel like we need some help. Yes. We're going to bring up a couple of natural DIY City Line super fans from the audience. Come on up here, Christina and Paul Binder. Come join us. Hi. I love that we can actually rely 
Veronica, on you can join me here. They've been watching the show so long, they can do these projects probably the uh, better than I can. I have my okay, your glasses will be good. Very nice. So, Colbinder, I wanted to talk to you a little bit about... Um, come on up closer. Yeah, yeah come closer, everyone. Go right in. Um, are you a DIYer? Well, I get the help of family members, yeah. but I do try and do a few things myself. And you do have, you've got tools at home yeah. that you use to do these projects. Christina, how about you? Yes, absolutely. All handy. My, all my, almost all my Christmas presents in my family are DIY. Oh, I oh, love it. <laughs> so isn't that a nice idea, the puzzle? Yes, I love that. I think that is beautiful. How about shots? Do you like those? <laughs> <laughs> I do. Okay. <laughs> all right. So why don't you tell us what we need to do, yes. uh, Joey? How so, do we Christina, do this? if you come over with me to the okay. chop shop, yeah. well, you'll be over here with Dave. And I'll be right here. <laughs> <laughs> and you you're, guys you're have your the safety glasses. Right. The okay, okay. Zone, well, I'll, I'll so. be right here. Do you want me to put, you me put these yeah, on Yeah, so you can put top? those on over oh, top. Right. So we'll get you started on the chop saw here okay. first. Have you used one of these before? Oh, yeah. Perfect. So you know your main notes. <laughs> Whatever. It's hold just the lumber here. Thursday. Start the saw off the wood. Go down yeah. nice and slow and easy. Oh, oh. and then there's also a little guard here. So you got to flip that to the side and then go for it. She's a pro. Easy, easy. Done it any now we'll pass it down over to the trim team. Oh, awesome. Yeah. So we are going to be drilling the hole here. So nice it on. might yeah, look like a complicated DIY, but really it's just cutting a piece of wood and drilling a hole. So okay. you're going to use this drill, and it's got a spade bit on it, and this is a half inch to match the threaded rod there, okay? So hold onto it tight, firm. You can use two hands. And I've got a hole here, and just drill right through that hole. Oh. Pull it back a little bit. Part of this All is right, just getting sec. people Let's to be a little bit it. more comfortable with using these power it. tools because they so sound scary. Hold it nice and firm. <laughs> oh, there you yeah. go. And pull it back on through. All right. That power. was your first try. Do another one. Do another one. Come here. Give me another chance here. Do another one? Yeah, let's um, do that one. Let's this? do that one. Yeah. Here, let's Good drill a hole in that. You've got you've got your practice down. I feel like you know you got one out of your way, and now now you're gonna be a pro with the next one. It's all about getting comfortable We're with it. And you notice that I have none in my hands. There you go. Now hold it <laughs> nice coffee. and firm. Hold that drill nice and firm, and go right oh, down through the hole. You got it. Nice, nice, nice. Oh. Repetition is everything with tools. Okay, I'm very impressed. It is about the repetition and it is about the building. So that's what I was supposed to be doing, but I was kind of engaged with what you all were doing. So once you put all of these on, you get to enjoy your shots, yes. which we have right here. So why don't right. you, I know you've got a mask on. Maybe you can just do the cheers with us. Sure. There you go, one for you. So, Happy holidays. Cheers. 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 This is to like getting comfortable with your power tools and hanging out with friends. Cheers you to go. you. Thanks cheers. to you for a lot. So good. Thank you so much. Beautiful holiday cheers. DIY.